If you're looking for some explosive summer lure fishing on rivers, then I can't think of a species that's more exciting to target on lures than chub. So I've selected five of my favourite Salmo hard baits for targeting chub in the summer months, and I'll explain to you how I like to fish them. Without a doubt, my favourite topwater lure for targeting chub is the lil bug, and some of the takes I've had on this lure over the years have been absolutely awesome. It's actually got quite a bit of weight to it, especially in the three centimetre model, as it's got a couple of ball bearings in there. So even if you want to fish at long distance, it casts a long way, and by keeping the rod tip up, it creates an absolutely fantastic wake across the surface that chub find hard to resist. So if I'm spotting a few chub, what I'll do is I'll cast in front of the fish a little bit, swim the little bug in front of them, and more often than not, they'll just nail it off the surface. So it's a fantastic lure to try in the summer months for chub. There are a variety of different hornets in the range that have worked well for me in the past when it comes to targeting chub. But if I had to choose one, I would probably select the Rattling Hornet Shallow in the three and a half centimetre model. It only dives six inches or so, so it's great for targeting chub that are sitting just under the surface and looking up for an easy meal. It's got a really loud rattle, and similarly to the little bug, it's got a ball bearing in there which helps it cast a long way when you're trying to cast into a strong wind. It's available in a variety of different colours. Personally, for fishing in crystal clear rivers like what I've been fishing today, I prefer to choose a, a very natural colour. So this is cock chaffer. Um, it's got like a brown, black sort of like mix of colours in there um, that can imitate a variety of different aquatic and non-aquatic insects that chub love to eat in the summer. Out of all the freshwater fish species in the UK, chub have got one of the most wide-ranging diets, but one of their favourite prey items are minnows, and the Salmo minnow is the perfect replica. There are floating and sinking options in the Salmo range. I really like both. I probably tend to use the sinking model more, especially when I'm cast into overhanging bushes, and what I can do is I can let the lure just sink under and fished on a very slow, steady retrieve. It's got a fantastic, irresistible wiggle. Um, you can impart little twitches into it to make it look like it's injured, like an injured minnow, but uh, I often find that just fishing it on a steady retrieve can often get quite a few bites. So the minnow is definitely one that I would have, especially if you're fishing in slightly deeper stretches of river for casting under overhanging bushes, but also if you are spotting fish, but they're sitting just a little bit deeper, a bit too deep for fishing something like a surface lure and you want to get down a bit more. So in those situations, give the minnow a swim. Although this is a lure that hasn't really been designed for chub in mind, the five centimetre executor has been very successful for me when fishing on small, shallow rivers. It's a very buoyant lure. It's made out of balsa wood, so it floats up to the surface quickly. And it's actually got quite a similar profile to a minnow. Okay, it's a little bit deeper than the Salmo minnow, but it has a, a really sort of subtle rolling action. So it, it can be a very effective lure for targeting chub when I've spotted a few fish, just swimming the executor in front can be a very effective way of targeting them. So that's another one to add to your selection. On small to medium sized rivers, like the chalk stream I'm fishing today, bullheads are another one of the main prey fish that chub love to eat. And I've talked about the Salmo bullhead many times before, but it's one of my favorite lures in the range, especially for targeting chub. I tend to use the smaller four and a half centimetre model most often, um, especially the sinking option. So it's got quite a bit of weight to it, so it actually sinks a little bit faster than some of the other models in the Salmo range. So if you're fishing somewhere where there's a slightly stronger current, I'll clip this on and it will just get down a little bit faster if I want to reach chub that's sitting a little bit closer to the bottom. The deeper diving model in the same size can also be worth a try when fishing on deeper stretches. And what I love about the bullhead is that you've always got the chance of catching quite a nice perch on one of these as well. Uh, it's a real get out of jail lure for me, this one. So slightly different profile and wobble. So another one to add to the mix. And if I'm spotting fish and I've, I've tried something like a little bug, and they're coming a little bit short coming up for a surface lure, this is a great one to try. So here's another Salmo that I would definitely add to your range. 